welcome back to Life of Kimmy. My name is Kimberly and this is Gigi. She is my three month old Cocker Spaniel. And <laughs> let me tell you a little bit about her. So she was a surprise. My parents surprised me with a puppy uh, three weeks ago. And I had no idea I was getting this puppy because before I was kind of like looking around for one, but they surprised me anyways. I didn't know I was gonna be ready, but I am officially a puppy mom and I have gone crazy with the shopping. Um, <laughs> so let me talk a little bit about her. I wanted to call her Polinka, like Gilmore Girls. Oh, baby. Um, but my siblings didn't let me. They were like, Kimberly, no. And for the past like 10 years, I wanted to name a dog Polinka. But that didn't happen, so I went with Gigi. And Gigi fits her perfectly because she's like a little drama queen. <laughs> so let's, let's get started with the video, or what we're here for. And so the thing is, I think dogs resemble their owners and in the past I've seen this multiple times but this past weekend we went to a dog park and we saw this really cool chick with jet black hair also have an awesome dog that looks just like her it's like a wolf type dog with jet black hair isn't that crazy um, so that was that and then all around like we kind of saw dogs with a re resemblance but what better examples than online <laughs> like this and this, come on guys, and over here. <laughs> Dogs resemble their owners all the time, but my boyfriend didn't believe this. So over the past three weeks, I've noticed that this is the same thing with me and Gigi. Although we don't have the same color hair, we both are very fashion-like. We love fashion, we love wearing bows, and also we like to wink, <laughs> like here. Ouch, and I'm not a biter, but she likes to bite. Uh, we also are really big with cuddling, aren't we, Gigi? Yes, we are. And we're also really, uh, we really love just, you know, having awesome times shopping. She likes PetSmart and Petco, and of course, I love different stores, but I love going over there too to purchase like all these cute things. Um, but anyways, I've noticed that I've had a lot of puppy troubles. I don't know if you guys have gone through this, and if you have, let me know in the comments down below um, of how you fix this or if you still have problems. I think I'm gonna take her to a training course uh, because she is crazy. Right, Gigi, are you crazy? She's crazy and every time of the day, except when she's sleeping. She's like the most adorable angel. But she has three flaws, three huge flaws. First is she's a biting monster. Oh, ow, ow, Gigi. She's a biting monster. <laughs> and she throws tantrums like a little teenager and she screams bloody murder every time we leave her by herself she just doesn't want to be alone but she also doesn't like being petted only if she's like falling asleep <laughs> anyways Gigi is still cute even though she has those little oh crazy flaws and vicious bites and she also has a cute little asparagus tail like this <laughs> Anyways, she's getting a little cranky, so I think this is going to be the end of the video. Ow! Gigi! Baby! She's, she, she's throwing her tantrums. <laughs> Anyways, guys, we're going to say goodbye. Thank you for watching this video. <laughs> Follow her on Instagram at Gigi the Cocker Spaniel. Follow me also on Instagram, but most importantly her. She's, she needs the attention. Um, and we'll talk to you guys later. Ouch, ouch, Gigi, no, baby, ow. <laughs> okay, bye guys. Pee? It doesn't smell like pee. <laughs> Are you recording? No. <laughs> To the dog park um, about a week ago, and I was telling my <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs>
Shake, shake, shake. 